You know, most high school athletes see college sports as a dream, and for one volleyball player from Detroit, it certainly became a dream come true, despite a family challenge along the way. Tonight, 7 Action News reporter Brad Galley shares the story of a teenager stepping up and growing up while making her dreams come true. Alexis Matthews didn't know at the time how much she was helping her family. I need mean, not tell everybody. It didn't really seem like a big deal to me at the time. Before her sophomore year at Detroit Renaissance, Alexis's mother got pregnant with twins. Life, as she knew it, was on hold. She had literally just turned six months uh, when she went into labor. That morning, my dad woke me up. He was like sprinting through the house, getting dressed. Um, you know, he's like, hey, just take care of your brother and sister. Your mom's going into labor. Our day, it was, it was a wonderful day, but it was the most, it was the scariest day that you could ever imagine because you just saw people in action and just moving in. It was kind of like in, in a panic. The twins, Dolores and Wendell, were born three months premature. They were so small that you literally could hold them in the palm of your hand and have room in your hand. Dolores, we had her for three days and then she, she passed. So Eric and Andrea's attention was put all on Wendell. Her parents, spending 18-hour days at the hospital, left Alexis in charge to raise her two other siblings. He was very just touch and go for a while, so that weighed heavy on all of us. There was no room for potential when it came time to see how Alexis would handle things as the stand-in mother. But on the volleyball court, potential was the exact thing that caught the attention of Michigan State head coach Kathy George. Alexis caught my eye and yet I needed to know could she do the same thing at, at the Big Ten level. I didn't think I was that good. <laughs> I wanted to get really good because I knew like the college game was you know leagues above what high school is. Just barely over the tape dug up by Wazinski. Nice pass set into the middle and Matthews hammers it down. Fast forward to 2013. Alexis, a now fifth year senior, has led Michigan State to a top 25 ranking, has picked up award after award, and her number one fan is her now seven year old brother, Wendell. The past two years he's not missed a game. We're already a very loving, supportive unit. It's so special to see everybody here and, you know, just cheering me on. In East Lansing, Brad Galley. 7 Action News. Really cool. After everything they went through, Alexis's mother, Andrea, opened the Wendell Dolores Resource House in Detroit to help other families after premature births. Yeah, I think you can see where her strength comes oh, from, yeah. comes from the family. By the way, the Michigan State volleyball team is in the Sweet 16 this weekend, so. Go State. See, good things, good people. Go see State. Go State. <laughs>